This course has been very enjoyable. Uh, while it provided training and insights into BYU-Idaho's educational philosophy and approach, it has also allowed us to experience enough of the educational strategies to make me very excited about the opportunity. As a former distance learning director at KIMAP University in Kazakhstan, I have a great interest in your online learning process, even if I am not selected to teach on it. I have also taken online courses from Dr. Shane Dixon, a BYU grad who co-founded uh, the largest TESOL certification program in the world uh, based at Arizona State University. Brother Dixon and I are part of a team that is now creating a new online language training program. With your approach and that used by the ASU program, I can see how interactive and effective online instruction can really be. Students teaching students is also a concept that I've believed in all of my adult life. A program I studied in the 1960s had poor uh, readers in the fifth grade tutor poor readers in the second grade during a summer program. During that uh, program, the second graders advanced a full year in their reading age, but the fifth graders advanced 3.4 years in their reading age. A lot of that gain, I believe, was uh, from having to prepare in their minds enough to understand their lessons adequately to communicate them to the younger students. I also believe that the spiritual orientation and student service-oriented interaction can help students achieve dramatic inside-out change in their learning. Uh, I worked seven years with the Migrant Education Program uh, in Washington State. Part of that work was with the award-winning Student Leadership Program that helped migrant students to believe that they really could achieve their dreams with a stepping stone approach of taking one small step at a time to achieve their big lifetime goals. In a flyer I prepared for, a, for the program, I expressed what I had witnessed in that program. I wrote, the ultimate key to achieving success with struggling students is to implement strategies that change kids from the inside out, that help the students themselves to change their priorities, their goals, and their vision for their future. If kids don't want to learn, you can't force them. But once they gain the desire to learn in order to achieve their own goals and vision, you can't stop them. I think the student-oriented approach taken by BYU-Idaho helps achieve that inside-out change. My stepson is not yet a member of the church, but just enrolled into BYUI in January. He previously attended my current university in Malaysia, had lots of friends here, and really enjoyed it. However, he enjoyed BYUI even more. The students, the teachers, the entire approach. While it is a challenge because English is his third language, he is working harder than he ever has before and achieving much better results than he did here. He has been really motivated by the on-campus approach uh, on which the online approach is based. As for challenges in teaching with BYU High, uh, the only thing I can think of is if my work on my uh, online training program makes it difficult to devote as much time as I would typically devote to my teaching. I tend to be a perfectionist, and therefore when I get paid for 40 hours, I typically put in 60 hours. I will certainly surpass what you require of me, but if I do not surpass what I demand of myself, I may feel somewhat frustrated. As for what I could contribute to the program, I became a consultant in computer-based multimedia education way back in 1994 and have been building my skills and knowledge ever since. Because many of my current students have weak English skills, I use Screencast-O-Matic to record all of my lectures, upload them to YouTube, which automatically uh, transcribes them so the students can read them, and embed their videos back into Moodle along with quizzes and online projects. Beyond that, my best contribution will be my very sincere efforts to share my knowledge, my experience, and my testimony with our students. I was raised as a Mormon-hating Protestant, but was led uh, to the church by the Spirit and have participated in many miracles during my lifetime. I love the Lord. And I absolutely know that he answers our prayers. And I would love to share my testimony as well as my knowledge and experience with our students at BYUI.